In this video, I will show you how you can inject a custom firmware payload into your Nintendo Switch using an RCM loader. Make sure to update to the latest version of the custom firmware you want to use before attempting this. To do that, head to the link in the video description for whichever custom firmware you want to use. In this case, we're going to be looking at Haketa. Download the latest release of Haketa uh, in a zip format. Once you've downloaded the latest update, plug your RCM loader into your PC using a micro USB cable. Open the zip file containing your custom firmware. Find the .bin file and drag it out. Open the folder corresponding to whichever custom firmware you wish to use, in this case, Aketa. Drag the .bin file into the folder. Delete the existing payload.bin file. Rename the new Haketa file to payload.bin. Now unplug the RCM loader. Use the button on the RCM loader to switch to the payload you want to use. Press and hold to switch to the next firmware. The LED on the front corresponds to which firmware version you're going to use. For Haketa, we're going to be using blue, so we know this is ready to go. Remove the jig from the rear of your RCM loader or use an alternative jig. Remove the right Joy-Con from your Nintendo Switch and, and slide the jig into the Joy-Con rail. Power off your Nintendo Switch. Plug the RCM loader into the bottom of your Nintendo Switch. Hold down the volume up button on the top of your Switch and press the power button. This will inject the custom firmware. As you can see we have now loaded into Haketa and we're ready to go.